Welcome back, everyone. Uh, I just wanted to make a very quick video today about something that I see being asked online all the time. Um, and that is how to build an app in Flutterflow that has multiple user types. And most people think they need to create separate apps, um, which I do not recommend um, unless uh, you have a good reason to. Uh, so let's dive right in. So this app is going to have members, vendors, and admins. Now, there is going to be a separate Flutterflow project and a separate app specifically for the admin dashboard. Um, but for this specific app, the admins will be uh, looking into this app as well and using it. So uh, we'll need to handle three different types of users for this one. And basically, once you have your enum set up, you're going to be saving that uh, somewhere in your user document or somewhere in your back end, right, to know which user uh, which role each user has. And this is uh, known as RBAC, role-based access control um, in software development. So let me show you exactly what happens. Um, we're gonna use conditional builder to essentially build out different widget layouts uh, based off of who the user is. So I have an app state here where I'm storing all my user info. You can take a look right here, um, tons of different fields, but we're going to select role here. And then once we select role, um, we basically click in here and we instantly get this role enum at the top. Um, and then we can just select whichever one, we, uh, the condition that we want to meet. So um, you can also see this being done in the nav bar here. So um, depending on the different type of users, we're going to basically have different nav bars. I hope this quick video gives you a high level uh, mental model on how to approach building uh, an app with different types of users. And uh, let me know if you have any questions or in general, what you think about this type of format.